Good evening, good night, good morning, whatever you guys are in the world. What? Tonight's journey. I'm trying to get a gimbal. Yeah. Iffy about this. Kind of excited. Got mixed feelings. Got a lot of mixed feelings about this. What? Mm. I'll try it out. See what happens. Maybe get some more buttery footage for you guys. But for right now, let's go inside, see what I get. I think I found it. Oh man, I'm excited. Finally picked up what I need to go pick up. Yo, why don't you try this thing out in the shop in the store? Too sick. Too sick. I needed one of these in my life. <laughs> I like buttery smooth shots. Now I can get buttery smooth shots when I'm driving. But it should be alright. But right now, recording on a, uh, what is it? Samsung 10S Plus. Pretty damn good. 60 frames a second. <laughs> I love it. Alright guys, gonna concentrate on driving though. See you in a bit. And we're back. Yeah. Henry's, thank you. This thing's amazing. Can't wait to open it. So, let's just get right to it. There we go. Believe it or not, yo, this thing is just under 120 bucks. When I went there, it was just like 109 bucks. 109 bucks plus tax. And actually, when uh, when I tried out in the store, somehow I got to try it out in the store with the whole COVID things. So I, I I don't know, I don't I don't know how that works. But when I tried it, it was amazing. I didn't want to put it down. <laughs> but you know what? This so this whole video is gonna just be about talking about this thing. The Moza, Moza Mini S. I'm telling you, it's worth it. If you want to do a setup for vlogging, anything, this thing is perfect. Absolutely perfect. Apparently, it comes with an app. So I'll check that out in a minute. Well, after we get into this a little bit more. But the whole thing for vlogging, perfect setup for vlogging. This gimbal any phone these days and one of these mics man these mics are absolutely sick these two things right now this mic you're hearing this mic right now you go check back on i believe what was my last video obviously my last video <clears throat> sound quality was crap but check this out Boom. Perfect mic. Sits right there. Got a little tripod in it and everything. But come back with an unboxing on this thing another time. But for now, we're doing him. Well, not him. Him. This guy. Right here. Alright. Back to this. So, real quick. Perfect setup for vlogging. You know, I'll, I'll just open up this guy first. Why not? Obviously, I already opened it up. <laughs> As you can tell. Oh yeah, I forgot these two things are in there. You know? Tiny little manual. But, quick, easy. Don't really need it. Yeah, don't this thing. And a little touch. I like the feel. Not bad. There we go. Oh, holds are pretty good. Right, and 
this for the DSL camera, mirrorless camera, any camera you got really, this thing will just plug right in, no issues. And we have a little tripod. This thing comes with everything at the time. And it's so tiny. So tiny. And I believe that's all that. Oh, look how low that is. You want those nice low angles? Nice tiny tripod? This thing is absolutely perfect also. Yeah, so, this is so, oh, let me drop this thing already. Since that thing is actually so big and small, I kind of like it like that, I'll just leave it open. Oh, wait, but, it also comes with little rubber pads right here. These little rubber pads right here. And you know what? With a little bit of weight on this thing? Not bad. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ran out of space on my phone. <laughs> Alright, anyways. Look, back to what I was saying. Just gonna leave this guy right here. Like it. Kinda cute. <laughs> what? Uh, I waited so long not to open this thing. <laughs> But it's time. So, this thing, first of all, takes a, a long time to charge. Well, for me, it took, honestly, it takes three hours. Yeah, three hours. Pretty long. But once you get it, you just want to take it out the box and use it. Alright, so let me just get right into it. Let's see what's in here. I don't know what to pick first. All right, let's see. Got this little bag. Keeps keeping my eye open there, you know, just because I have to charge it. Nice little bag. Got your, I believe this is the phone adapter cable. Show this to you in a second. And DSLR hookup thing. I like it. This thing's gonna be sick. It's gonna be sick. I know. So I charged it, but I really didn't get to use that much. That's why I'm still so stoked to use it. And you also get your little tripod with it. But this one's perfect. It looks right at the bottom. There you go. That's that. Alright, let's turn this thing on. First, we're gonna unlock it. Key. Well, unlock button. Unlock button, lever, thing. Whatever you wanna call it. A little tip, I guess, when you're opening this thing, just make sure you have this part perpendicular to the arm. Probably make it a little bit easier because it's a little tight. And when you're done, pop it out. She's ready to go. But this is the funny thing. 
if you turn this thing on without the phone in here it will just wiggle around and fall down I guess it's not gonna hurt it because I did it a couple times already stay at the end for the bloopers <laughs> this thing was too funny to mess around with so just gonna do this just put your hand right here Well, that just made me look stupid. Because now it's fully charged. It's not going down. You just got to make sure everything's leveled. And good. Bubble 4. <sighs> so, it did it. <laughs> it was trying to sense the fall. But that's all it does. It does. I believe you just click it. You hold it. Boom, comes off. You want it to come back on? I believe you just, yep, you just hold it. Throw the lights flash. And she comes on. Do that thing. I'm still just gonna put my hand in because I know it's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, just turn it off. All right. Try to get some footage for you guys. Real quick before I show you guys that little video of what this gimbal actually does. Well, that's a little hard to see because it's black on black. But, this guy, right here, goes right there. Well, obviously, you can see. So, pretty simple. Phone's right there. Pretty nice connection. Can't ask for anything better. Like, Man, one second. Damn. This thing. Pretty sick. So I angled the camera down just so you could see when I move the, the hand out a little second. You could even control it right there with a the little joystick in your hand. It's perfect, dude. Like, you, if if you look for a gimbal, this is what you need. It's so smooth, so nice. Even has like good stability for your cameras. Oh yeah, there you go. A little bit more than this guy. Take you guys for a little walk test. Not bad. Not bad. I'm walking pretty. F I'm spinning this pretty fast. It's not this thing works so good, guys. Keep in mind it's only a uh, three axis. Hey, it's still pretty good. What do you guys think? This thing's sick. But, honestly, why, I don't know why I didn't get one before. <laughs> so, I hope you guys like the video. You know, go check this thing out. Moza, 3-axis gimbal. This thing's awesome. This thing's actually awesome. But, I'm going to check out the app in the next video with the whole tracking thing and a whole bunch of other features. So my next video, I'm just gonna keep just, you know, explain this thing a little bit more. And then after I use it for a month or two, come back with another update video on this. I'll let you guys know what I think about it. I don't think it's gonna let me down though. The quality of this thing is amazing. But thanks for watching, that's it for me. Subscribe, like, smash that subscribe button and like button helps out a lot all right guys have a good night
this is gonna be epic. What I did, what what I got is epic. Just, just just know that what I got is actually epic. I'm gonna stop saying that now. <laughs> Yo, but this video, oh my god, I can't get over this thing. Like I'm just thinking about it. You'll see. It. You'll see. But this video is gonna be about a really old, old, antique lens. Man, I already see how this thing worked. It looks so good. Well, let me know what you guys think. Review coming up.